So we're here pulling up to this place right here called Sage Culinary Studio. So Rolling Burritos is almost open and obviously like it says right here, it's a food truck. But with that, you need a commissary, which is what DuPage County and I believe any type of mobile food service, you need this to be able to get a license. So what you do here is like it's a commercial kitchen. Have a food business, do you do catering, baking, food trucks, food delivery, canning, meal prep, packaging, confectioning. So what this is, is it's a like a commercial kitchen. So in DuPage County, specifically what you do is as a mobile food vendor, you don't have electricity 24 seven. So what happens is the health department considers you like a part time, if you want to call it. So they need somewhere for you to take, let's say you have a hot dog cart and you sell 100 hot dogs, but you have 125 hot dogs that you took that morning to your cart. So there's 25 that are left over. So with that, you need to take them somewhere. And that's where this comes in. This is a commercial kitchen where every day that you are not running your normal business hours, you bring your stuff back. You rent space from a commercial kitchen in here somewhere. And this is a new one that they built here in Naperville. We're gonna go inside right now and check it out. This is DuPage County. So this one would have worked for my commissary, but I already have one that I'm working with. But I'm curious to see, the reason I'm here is that I'm curious to see how much they charge to be here. So with that, let's walk in, let's check it out. Rolling Burritos is the food truck that's gonna be open here for breakfast burritos. But that's kind of like what a commissary is, is a physical brick and mortar business that has electricity, plumbing, all the time 24 7 where you can bring your extra food that you don't use or whatever you bring like from a distributor you can store it here all the water that you use to wash your dishes and things like that you dump the water here too and then you get new clean water so you can use it in your food truck so with that let's go inside real quick let's see what the numbers are for this business